Hey, what's up, guys? It's Snap's G here with another video. And in this video, we got rank three six star Corvus gameplay. So, I got three clips to show. Uh, this first one is just rank three Corvus with no boost and no synergies. And then the next two, um, it's gonna have synergy. I'm gonna use full synergy, just like an attack synergy, some random and full boosters. So, yeah, well, let's get into this. So, this first clip, uh, I just wanted to test out rank three Corvus in variant four i think quest one and i also awakened him with an awakening gem um so i finally got to use his awakened ability which i've never been able to use before so um the rank um the rank three is definitely a lot stronger i found got really strong in some parts with the max boost it was fucking crazy but this first fight is just a namor he's kind of annoying um because he regenerates but i throw a special one fights over I get two charges from this fight because he's an Avenger and a mutant. So now we get to start the actual path. So I think it's an all or nothing path. I think I misclicked that. So we're gonna go around the close end. Um, this is the um, first f uh, quest in variant four. The variant where this level or this quest, I'm pretty sure you can only bring in five and six stars. So I just brought in six star Corvus, literally no one else. It's all or nothing path. And just right off the bat, um, with class advantage and we got our first fight, we're already critting for 11.1k. That is crazy. Like, I can't even just believe, like, these crits are disgusting. They just, like, that guy stood no chance. That and Patriot got just slapped. So we got our third charge in that fight because there was a tech character. Now all we need is the evade or auto block one, which we won't get in this fight, but we'll get in the next one, I'm pretty sure. So for this fight, it's Magneto. The new Magneto is kind of annoying to fight um, now because sometimes your parries won't land because I'm using a metal character. And then normally after that, you'd like to bait out heavies, but his heavy has an unstoppable, so it's kind of annoying. But nonetheless, we're, we're critting for 9.5k without class advantage, which is crazy. I mean, this guy, uh, once again, he's just dead. So easy. And these are like 150, 200,000 health opponents, just getting like slaughtered like they're nothing. So. Next, we get this Mordo fight. Um, this is where I got my fourth charge. Um, I could just hit into his stun, get Astral Evaded, and Astral Evade counts as normal Evade. So I, once I got Evaded, I just baited a heavy, and then I threw my heavy. So I got four charges. So I got all four charges, hitting for 8.6k mediums with class disadvantage and all the charges. I think with all the charges um, and class advantage, you'd be hitting for like 12, 13k. So it's pretty crazy. Um, so the numbers get really crazy once we get add the boost soon, which you'll see. But I just jumped into this quest um, right when I ran three him just because I didn't know what to fight, uh, what to do. So um, yeah, I thought this would be a good showing just to see. So this is a cable, just once again. And keep in mind, all these fights have been all or nothing. So it's just kind of like bullying. We're just straight up bullying these guys. Um, it's really easy. It is really easy. So. Going to this fight, just medium, mediums, whatever. Um, these guys are just a so squishy for my Corvus. Like, I'm like not even getting close to using all my charges, and they're just dead. So right here, I put um, he goes to three bars of power, so I just push myself to two, and then it was a little bit of overkill. Um, special one would have finished him off, but whatever. He's dead, and then we get the final fight. This is the first fight ever I've used Corvus's awakened ability for because I've had six star Corvus for like almost a year probably more than that probably like a year and a half I don't know and I also have the five star but I, I, I never had either of them awakened so this is the first fight where I've used his awakened ability and I gotta say um I'm impressed people are right the just the uh, immunity to death is very nice this is like a crazy power gain electro boss and he has some weird node where he puts like these degens on you. I don't really know, honestly, what it's called. The degens are kind of weak, though. Um, but yeah, it's just kind of annoying being on the specials. So this is the first fight ever where I got to see what my um, awakened ability does. And I'm just chilling at 1%. And if you don't know what Corvus's awakened ability does, it's um, if you as long as you have like those charges up, um, you can't die. Um, so yeah, right here, I push myself to special 2 and finish the fight. So yeah. Pretty fun indeed. Pretty fun indeed. So the next clip we go to is in Act Six Point Three Point Five, I believe. We got full synergies and max boost. 
This is one of the big ass 250 to 320,000 health pool paths. And I do this whole path and the boss in I think eight minutes or something. So it's destruction. So just look at this. This is the first fight. And just with all the armor breaks, we're creating for 11.5k with zero charges. We don't have any charges yet. So this is max boosted uh, and like just an attack synergy. So our mediums are doing like eight, nine K uh, with like with um, no armor breaks. Our mediums are doing like eight K, which is like basically like rank two Corvus with like a few charges with <laughs> no charges, not boosted. Special two almost kills Red Skull. I think I get hit with a special two here, yeah. But the special two, I, I literally just destroyed this fight and I have no charges. So now, now I have charges. Now I have one charge from Red Skull. And, um, yeah, I just hit pretty fucking hard. You'll see in the Howard the Duck fight some crazy-ass numbers. Um, but we'll wait until that one comes. So, switch to Corvus. Get this charge. Um, we didn't get to see what four charges max boost look like. I don't know why. I didn't think of that. But I should have done a path that gave us four charges while I had max boost. Just so I could see the damage was, like, max. I think at the most with four charges, it's, like... 15 16k crits on the mediums which is just crazy and then other characters like red skull and howard the duck with a lot of armor just make it even more just sad how much strong he is so right here i think i did a special two uh didn't kill him but i should have thrown like one more light attack and he would have died but whatever get the kill we get our second charge and i think on this path we only get two charges but whatever so I want you to look at this Howard the Duck fight. He starts with like six armor ups or something. And right when the fight starts, I parry and take all of them away into armor breaks. Look at these medium crits. Are you ready for this? You ready for this? This is about to fucking blow your mind. Ready? Parry. Bop. Dude, I am getting 23 almost thousand mediums. 23,000 crits. That is special. And then without... Uh, any armor breaks, I'm creating for 15k mediums with two charges. So, yeah, I have like 17, 18k with um, four charges in class advantage and max boost. It's just, it's like destruction. So, yeah, I mean, it's just amazing. So, we're going to keep going here. Next, we got, uh, who is this? Emma Frost. I, I was checking, I think, to see if I had any energy. So, just keep in mind, these fights are big health, like 300,000 health, some of these, and they're getting knocked over by Corvus with relative ease. So I, I, can't, I will say at rank 3, um, his reach is definitely a lot farther than rank 2. And then to throw it even more, you could throw a max boost on him. And if you want to make him even more powerful, you can put a cosmic power boost. But in this quest, I didn't just because it would have been overkill. I mean, I think most things are dead by the special two in this quest, so yeah. Keep going at this Heimdall. I could have gotten a third charge here, but I was getting unlucky. Um, when you use Corvus, um, you kind of want to get auto blocked by Heimdall normally, because then you can get the charge for getting auto blocked, but of course my luck was bad. So, right here, we're getting just straight off the bat f like almost 13k mediums. 13k without class advantage. That is, like, in only two of the four charges. That's just crazy, dude. That, that, like, max boot... Like, rank three Corvus is already insane. And then you throw the max boost on, and it's just... It's such overkill. Like, these fights are just dying. These 300,000 health fights are just straight up just dying. Like, they're just not lasting, like, long at all. So, I mean, it's beautiful. Honestly. So, next we got Civil Warrior. And just for a second, let's just appreciate this P.I., I think I got, what, like 27,000 to almost 28,000 PI. That's fucking crazy, dude. Right here, get these media, 16K mediums. It's just, it's bullying, dude. 10K light. Um, what are those combos? Uh, 20,000 plus, that's 50,000 combos just from four hits. 52,000, really. Um, but uh, just from a five hit combo, 50,000. Four five hit combos, and that's two hundred thousand health plus the L two. I mean, I could do medium light medium, but like it's just over. I don't need to. The damage is high enough as itself. This is what like a three hundred. I didn't get to see it was three hundred twenty three hundred forty thousand health. Howard the uh, Venom the Duck, like these massive like three hundred thousand plus health pool fights that like I just remember my rank two Corvus just struggling with. I mean, you got max boost and six star rank three. It's just. 
it's destruction. I mean, it's like not even funny how hard these guys are getting fucked. Like it's not even like they're not. They have no chance. They literally have no chance of survival. <laughs> so right here, we're gonna get to a special two, and the fight should be over. So yeah, at least three hundred thirty health, three hundred thirty thousand health pools are just getting fucking destroyed. And keep in mind, this is a full path plus the boss, an act six point three point five, which has some of the biggest health pools in the game. I think. 6.3 some of the quests have bigger health pools than 6.4 so yeah keep that in mind um it's just crazy so next we got this angela fight she's the last fight on the quest i mean there's nothing too special about this fight because i mean this path has kind of just been the same it's just get to a special two and they die and um it's just it's just straight up bullying but i really enjoy the uh, mysterio fight i one shot the mysterio fight max boosted with a six star rank two corvus okay before it got nerfed and i barely got the one shot but now six star rank three max boost with the mysterio nerf they nerfed him a little bit um the fight's just like this fight used to be like close to an impossible one shot or, like really hard to one shot and now it's just like relative ease just straight up clapping mysterio's cheeks dude um what is this this is a 500,000 of five five hundred. 500 something thousand I couldn't really see because the editing software is kind of blurry but it's a fat health pool you guys can probably see it clearer than I can but just look at the health and then look at this is a Corvus as keep in mind it has it's a Matador tunnel vision so tunnel vision you can't do the same thing twice so you're gonna miss and Matador you get a bar power whenever they throw a bar power so this fight is a lot easier now I don't know what they did exactly with the nerf but I do know that they made it the only thing I do know is that they made it it's um armor break used it used to be armor break immune which made it a little bit harder but yeah like already just fucking what uh six medium hits in and he's already done 20 percent i mean it <laughs> dude it's just it's straight uh, savagery dude so the way you play this fight is you just get him to special one you gotta get him to throw it and then you throw your special two so matador is a pretty good node for corvus honestly because it's easier to build the enemy's power than yours and you can swipe back a shit ton to get the falter on you and get free willpower healing. But I'm not going to do that. So throw the special two. 25, 25k, 75k. That was a 125,000 special two. Casually just dropping those. Yeah, man, it's just beautiful, honestly. So we got a falter on us. Um, yeah, keep it going. Keep parry stunning this guy. Dodging the specials. I think we get gypped. I think this fight could have ended a lot faster, but I think... I think he um didn't give us power for something. I forgot what it was. I think this next special I don't get power for for some reason. Like, he doesn't give me the second bar power. Or maybe he does. Okay, it happened earlier. I guess I wasn't paying attention. But there's one point it didn't happen. So he throws this. And then we just throw the special two and he's dead. So, yeah. Easy kills. Next, the final clip. I wanted to go into Realm of Legends. So I used Magneto for all the fights before this. So there's two fights I wanted to do. Storm to get the initial charge. Because I want to see how hard it is. Max boosted rank 3 Corvus. Just to get a charge in Realm of Legends. So I have no charges. And I'm trying to kill a 500,000 health plus um, opponent. So as you can imagine, it's not the most fun. So for this first fight, special 2. I get like a almost less than a bar power back because of the I have a cosmic power boost in this, and then um, once I get this charge, the next fight after is a tech character vision, so we have the class advantage. So I want to see how much damage we can do with the class advantage and a max boosted rank three corvus with a cosmic power boost. So this first fight is a little bit of struggle. Um, it's basically uh, we just have to go through two cycles and then he's she's dead. So it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be, honestly. So really, Corvus can do these realm fights in two cycles of his charges. But what's really impressive is after I get this charge on Storm, the next fight. I'll show you that in a second. Uh, I had to put it in here because um, I, I, it, it never thought it would be done. What's going to happen, which you'll see. Uh, I never thought Corvus would have the reach to do. But yeah, first we got to get there. So what I'm trying to do is get to close to three bars of power. And then right when I get my charges back, I can just launch a special two. And then I'll get power back and I'll be right at another special two, basically. So yeah, right here, we're just dodging, trying to kill time, trying to get our charges back. Throw a five combo. Wait for her to throw a special one or something. No, then we throw a special two. 
crit, crit, crit. It did what? I think that was like a 60,000 special too. So not like crazy, but we got to another one. Another 60,000, throw them back to back. Uh, and then we just can finish the fight. I think I go for a special one and it doesn't kill her. I was pretty sad about that. But now we get the charge. So with a charge, Roma Legends fight, 500 plus, 500,000 plus health vision. I am able, I think it's 540,000. Once again, the editing software is super blurry, so I can't see. So this is a massive fight. And I am able to, in this fight, kill vision with just 20 glaive charges. Which sounds crazy, I know, but the tactic I use here is medium light instead of medium light medium because we get to throw more hits so we get more power, more chances to throw special twos. So with only 20 clave charges, and I don't think at all I have to um, just do like the light hit just so we don't have to do, I think every combo I'm still throwing a crit. So it's not like I'm doing that one strategy where you just spam a shit ton of lights, one hit combos, that's terrible. So I throw the special two, get a bar a little bit power back, okay? Hit him some more, one hit, to two hit combos, two hit combos. I think we want to get a little bit more power here so we can throw back-to-back -back specials, which you're about to see. With just 20 glaive charges, I am able to kill a 500,000 plus health opponent with Corvus. So that is just absolutely crazy. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give a like, comment, and subscribe. Um, it was a little bit of overkill at the end, so I'm pretty sure... That just those 20 glaive charges, max boosted rank 3, would have had enough reach for like 600,000 health. So that is fucking insane how strong he is with the cosmic power boost, max boosted rank 3. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Give a like, comment, subscribe, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.